On the campaign, I would often say, when we fight, we win. But here's the thing, here's the thing. Sometimes the fight takes a while. That doesn't mean we won't win. Vice President Kamala Harris publicly conceded the 2024 presidential election to Donald Trump on Wednesday by encouraging her supporters to continue, quote, the fight for freedom. On Wednesday at Howard University, Harris thanked her husband, Doug, as well as President Joe Biden and her campaign staffers, while the crowd chanted her name. The light of America's promise will always burn bright. As long as we never give up and as long as we keep fighting. During her speech, Harris called for a peaceful transition of power, but said she's not relinquishing the fight that fueled her campaign. While I concede this election, I do not concede the fight that fueled this campaign. The fight, the fight for freedom, for opportunity, for fairness, and the dignity of all people. She went on to say, do not despair. This is not a time to throw up our hands. This is a time to roll up our sleeves. This is a time to organize, to mobilize, and to stay engaged for the sake of freedom and justice and the future that we all know we can build together. The election was awarded to Trump on Wednesday morning after Wisconsin was called in favor of the former president and current president-elect, earning him the 270 electoral votes necessary to regain control of the White House. Towards the end of her speech, Harris addressed the country's young people, saying, please know it is going to be okay. Don't ever give up. Don't ever stop trying to make the world a better place. You have power. You have power. And don't you ever listen when anyone tells you something is impossible because it has never been done before. For more on this story, go to THR.com. This is The Hollywood Reporter News.